These are the brand new Roaring Moon and Iron Valiant EX boxes for the Paradox Rift series. Now Paradox Rift hasn't been the greatest set for us, but I'm hoping that these boxes may change that. So let's rip into them and see what we get. We haven't opened up any Iron Valiant yet, so let's go with it. Alright, first layer up, we've got our Black Star promo is the Iron Valiant EX, the Iron Moth, and the future booster energy yada 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 go card so the iron moth was definitely an interesting choice definitely really interesting for the trainer um i mean it's cool they're both hollows but this iron valiant ex my favorite thing about this if you can see the hollow pattern look at all the different stars and stuff that is the coolest hollow pattern i've seen in a while I absolutely love that. Of course, we can't forget about our big boy, the Iron Valiant EX Black Star Promo Jumbo Card, which also also has the same hollow pattern. That's sick. So this is interesting. On our second layer of the packs, we have two Paradox Rifts, one Obsidian Flame, and one Paldea Evolve. I'm actually really surprised at that. I did not think that that was a thing. Uh, I thought that we would have been all Paradox, but I guess not. So that's definitely interesting, but hey, I'm cool with it. We'll go all sorts of Scarlet and Violet on this set here. So let's see what we get. All right, we got Miss Drevis, Sneasel, Gothita, Meryl, Zuelis, Mousehold, Sedatan, Dendra, Bombardier, and the Obama Snow Hollow. All right, next pack is Obsidian Flames. So, I'm sure a lot of you guys are aware already, uh, the funny thing about the Pokemon community is, especially when collectors aren't happy with hit rates of certain series, um, I'm sure you guys have heard the names like Rebel Trash instead of Rebel Clash, uh, Chilling Pain instead of Chilling Rain, stuff like that. The funny thing is, is that Paradox Rift has been out for uh, almost a month now. And they've already came up with their own <laughs> with their own name for it because I think some people are not the biggest fan of it. Everyone is starting to call it Paradox Thrift, as in like thrift store, and I, it's it's hilarious to me. And I get it, I really do. Uh, Paradox Rift has not been the kindest to me either. It has been hit or miss at best. Oh, what's happening? Let go. Uh, I get like I said, I get it. I get it. Uh, there's definitely, there's definitely still like potential within the set, but some people just they're already done with it. They can't take it anymore, so they have deemed it paradox thrift, and it is pretty funny. Zacian Hollow. So it's not the greatest. I still actually really enjoy this set. I hope to finish it one day. I'm not in a rush to finish this one in any anytime soon. But I, I, I like it. I like it. The, the chase cards that have been out, like the Roaring Moon, the Gold, and the Iron Valiant, and stuff like that, I've seen I've seen them come around. They're like they're, If people are just a little bit more patient, maybe they'll be surprised on what this series can do. Because I, I, I still stand behind it. I really do. Even though it's kind of letting me down right now. Bombardier EX. Alright, so I guess we can go ahead and make this competition. We got literally one hit out of that box, out of the Iron Valiant box. Let's see what the Roaring Moon gives us. All right, so on our first layer of the Roaring Moon box, we have, this time we have the Ancient Booster Energy Capsule. We have the Roaring Moon EX and the Brute Bonnet. So I was taking another look at these, these Ancient and Future cards, mainly because there's a sick little swirl right there to the left of the, I don't know if you can see it right there. Right, there's a sick little swirl. But then I also noticed that the hollow pattern, how these cards, how they run off like that, it stays where the color is. All right here, there's no hollow. So I think that's that's cool. Little stuff like that, little attention to detail stuff that Pokemon does like that. I love that stuff. Big Boy, Roaring Moon, EX, Jumbo Card, Black Star Promo. Now I'm gonna go ahead and guess that, yeah, our lineup is gonna be the exact same. Two Paradox, Rift, Obsidian Flames, and a Paldea Evolved. Now I actually think it's interesting that Paldea Evolved is in here because if you haven't heard yet, the new set that will be coming out, I believe, the first of the year, or maybe earlier than that, they're taking a twist on 
what is it? Like we've had hidden fates, we've had shining fates. Now we are going to have Paldean fates with all the shinies and what have you. <laughs> I'm just, I, I just don't understand why they picked that name. I feel like they really <laughs> screwed the pooch on that one. Like they <laughs> just a little lazy. That could just be me. Like I, I don't know. Hidden fates sounded sick. Shining fates even better. Paldean Fates, and I think uh, the Japanese version that actually just came out, or is on its, uh, should be out soon, is Shining Treasures, I think is what it's called. That's great. That's perfect. Paldean Fates? Come on. We can't, we can't start randomizing, you know, names that we've already used and just, you know, yeah, that sounds good. It's like we're drawing them out of a hat or something. Come on, Pokemon. You, you do better than that. Get creative. Barboach. Oh, the Tyranitar EX. I didn't realize before, but that was actually the Delta species Tyranitar. And I actually don't have that one for the Obsidian Binder yet, so kudos to that. But we are down to two packs left. We've got two Paradox Rift. I'm not gonna say Rift. I don't. I'm not there yet. I think it's still okay. I haven't opened up a lot lately. Uh, the first little bit that we opened up, like that ETB we got, we got a Alt Art right off the bat. Like I couldn't be mad about that. And I've got the other version on the way because I want the I wanted both promo cards. So we'll see how that one does. See if we'll get another altar. And oh, we doubled up. What? This is weird. This is the second time this has happened. In two. Uh, I don't know. I am I in a matrix right now? See, I believe it was in the last video we had two very similar products, and we ended up getting we ended up doubling up on the two collection box i think it was like the iron treads ex or something like that it, weird like the odds of that are very i would think low maybe i'm wrong maybe i'm overthinking it but that's just weird especially for it to happen again so i don't, <laughs> I don't know last bag magic let's see what we get we got foy coco rika uh oh gorgist professor sata's vitality elekid or beetle and this Shin Pao Hollow. Well, I think the Roaring Moon box is definitely gonna take that one. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, smash that like button. Subscribe with the notification bell on. Let me know down in the comments what you'd like to see me open next. Thank you for joining my Pokemon journey, and remember, this is only the beginning. See ya!